The football season has kicked off. Teams are breaking down film, they're preparing for the next game, they're in the film room. While they're doing that, DraftKings Sportsbook, an official sports betting partner of the NFL, is also drawing up a win and play for all new customers. All new customers need to do is sign up using my promo code NITTY, that's Nitty, NITTY, bet $5 on any team before the game kicks off, any of the 32 NFL teams, before you know they kick the ball off, they will receive $200 in free bets if the team they pick wins. That's right, new customers bet $5 on any team to win their next game will get additional $200 in free bets. Plus, with same game parlay, you can combine multiple bets from the same game to give yourself a shot at even bigger winnings all season long. For those in states where sport betting is not yet available, don't forget about DraftKings Daily Fantasy, where they have been innovating even more ways to win some cash this football season. DraftKings has been around for a while, a good, good minute, so you know your funds are safe. You can withdraw your funds whenever, wherever you want. So download DraftKings Sportsbook app now. New customers use promo code N-I-T-T-Y, that's Nitty, that's me, N-I-T-T-Y, and receive $200 in free bets if the team you pick wins after you place a $5 pregame wager. That's promo code N-I-T-T-Y only at DraftKings Sportsbook. Behind the scenes, y'all. Behind the scenes. The carnage after you vlog or do a talking head video. Oh, <laughs> look all the shoes. I Guys, there's something I never really talk about much, yo. Is that Florida. It rains a lot. It rains a lot. And what happens when it rains? All the tourists, that go to the outlet. They can't go to the parks. It's rained out. So, we all conjugate at the outlet, man. <laughs> it's like a family reunion. So here's the tip. For all you guys, all you future tourists who plan to visit Orlando, Central Florida, try to come after September. It's not as rainy. You know what I mean? The rainy seasons is July, August, September. You could probably throw May in there. Matter of fact, May to September, expect rain and lots of it. What's poppin' homies? Is your boy Frank Needy back in the building. Guys, I finally made it. I am back. At the premium outlet on Violin, man, there's a few stores in this vicinity. We got a Nike outlet, obviously. We got Adidas. We got Reeboks. And for clothing, we got Gap, Polo, Guess, Tommy, the whole shebang, Nordica. Guys, I know these vlogs is no longer about me. You know, when it first started, I was always vlogging, trying to find the dopest deals. But when I start showing you guys what I've been seeing, a lot of you guys took interest and this channel, YouTube, has blown up. Now, we're on a road to 100,000K, but during that road, the content has shifted a little bit, and I realized it's no longer about me. A lot of you guys find value in these videos, and you guys want to pull up and go shopping. Some of you guys travel from abroad to come here, to come here to go shopping based off the deals and steals that you see in these videos. That said, guys, I'm going to start vlogging different places, man. Clothing, sneaker stores, Nike, obviously, but this video is about us, so that's why we shifting the tone a little bit. Anyways, man, let's uh let's keep it moving, man. I'm getting random stares because I'm a vlogger now. <laughs> Guys, it is really nice out here. En route, it rained a little bit, but out here is still nice and sunny. Maybe a little bit overcast, slightly overcast. People been shopping. That's good. That's always a good thing. Um, but anyways, man, we're like uh. Two minutes before we get in the building possibly three seconds for you guys i always make this mistake yo <laughs> so i think it's this way 
Yeah, it said please enter. Say word. These are ready in the building for $200. <laughs> Yo, this just came out. Size 11 is the biggest, though, man. No additional discounts, unfortunately. Uh, but you got $10 slides. $9.97. Whole bunch of different sizes. And they got my size, size 12. But I got so many slides, I'm going to have to politely pass. Some 95s in the building. Are they platinum? Where are they? 95s Essentials, white, white, gray fog. What are these? These are $169.97. No colorway on them, though. Okay, now this is different. This reminds me of the, the Viotex. Nice suede, some loud colors. 140 is the price. Black box, Air Max, 90s, size 12 right here. Let's take a look. Okay. Not bad. 160 for these, 270s. We passing though. And they got the 270 all reds, the red Octobers. I do like. 109 is the price. Oh, and they got the white joints. White, wolf gray. We got more 270s for 90, that's a lot cheaper. Yo, I remember this color came out like a few years ago. What was the production date on this? 21, November 21. So yeah, I'm not crazy for thinking that. I guess they've been holding out on them. A few sizes left in the building. Now here's the hash wall. I know I haven't been showing hash walls lately because there's really not much to show in hash walls. These 89s has not gone down in price and these 89s are going for 89. They got some 97s here. Funky color, 185. And then they got these loud vault up tempos for 160. Oh, there's a few of them too. There's a few of them in the building. Let me slide around. You got these N7 joints. 80 beans down. That came down significantly. This would be a lot more. These LeBrons, bro. <laughs> They're still in here for 195. What else? Some Prestos, size 11. Oh, the LeBrons. 99 any additional discounts no just an entire wall y'all no additional discounts wow they still got these joints was this intentional 109 <laughs> passing oh they're trying to change it up the impacts se's 100 beans they got new colors man but i don't think they're moving though you got the harachis for 120 oh that color's cool oh wow they got the bows now this is fire I'm happy to see this here. Not that price though, but I'm happy to see it, man. It's potential. Hopefully it go down in, in price. They got my size. Do they have my size? No, they do not. Damn. Dope. 80 for these. We passing though. All right. You got the BWs. 06 for 100 beans. And then you got these. These been here for a while, man. I think the last time I seen these shoes in any building was in this building. The Air Max 90, a lot of familiars. I think the LHM. The box is crazy, though. I do like the box. Remind me like a SB box, to be honest with you. Oh, wow. Yeah, a lot familiar. Look at the packaging, yo. The pretty packaging it comes with. I'm not mad at it, though. Nice packaging, nice box. Very vibrant colors. One third is the price. More B dubs. OG. I like. There's a 12 and a half. That's very, very uh, uncommon to see a 12 and a half. Are right, we keeping it moving? Oh, wow. 80 beans. All right. So we're in the basketball section. We're taking a look at these LeBrons. Yeah, they're not moving. 120 is the price. And here is the shoe where I had my episode. Fun fact, yo. I actually had these on feet <laughs> when, um, when I blacked out. Technically, you could call these a blackout. I think that's what I'm going to call it from now on. The blackout. Told you. 14 blackouts. They're going for 90 beans. I pay a lot cheaper for mine. What are these? More LeBrons, right? Yeah. Witness fives. Yeah, these are the witness fives, right? Yeah. Moving past that. And you got the LeBron 18s, all black. Not to be confused with the blackout soldiers, <laughs> but these been the same price everywhere. KD tray fives. Oh, these are the fours for 85 beans. KD fives. Tray fives, fours. <laughs> this is still the basketball section, but don't got nothing. You know what I mean? Like non-signature basketball shoes. And these are supposed to be the Jays right here as well. Nothing nothing much for Jays, y'all, unfortunately. Now, there's another row. We'll comb through that aisle real quickly. But I just want to show you this little side aisle. This aisle really used to never have much. But now, I guess they're getting so much quantity, they got to create another aisle. Why am I light on? Now, I thought this was another basketball aisle. But it's not for men, though. It's for kids. You got the air up tempos. 
97s, but these are kids' shoes. Yeah, these are all kids, man. No men basketball at all. Where? Did I skip an aisle? Man, that's been the corner, man. I feel like I skipped an aisle. Um, nope, I didn't. <laughs> Did not skip an aisle. Look what I stumbled upon. It's a Midnight Navy 6s. But these are GS. 140 is the price. Dope shoe. I do have them. I love them. And they got some one lows as well. Oh, these are different. I have never seen this one at all. MA2s, 100 beans, more J's, but they're not the retros y'all care for. I think they got the retros behind the, the cash, the cashier, so, or the checkout, or whatever. What do you call it, bro? My mind ain't right. <laughs> so, I just left the clothing section. There was nothing much over the record. And I just walked back into the kids, and I saw these 13s. I'm like, that's odd. But right next to it are these 6s. They're going for 150 though, so look, they're still going for retail. And these are going for 140 And there's a few of them, too, man. There's no shortage of them <laughs> at all. These Air Max is going for 170 Okay. All right, y'all. So just to reiterate, there's nothing over in clothing, man. I've been over here. I walked through it like three times. I don't see anything at all. I don't see much sales. I don't see T-shirts that remotely are interesting nothing the only thing i saw that was remotely interesting are these socks which i did want a pair of they're nine dollars they're unc but they only go up to a six eight and men and the ten and women they're fired though and i haven't forgotten about you ladies yeah it's not much going on over here either yeah give you guys the walkthrough i do like these though 135 Ooh, there you go is that are you seeing that it's too bright what about these now the details on this is crazy. Guys, this is crazy. I still don't even know the name of it. Recently, uh, these came out. I haven't even researched the name, man. But that's crazy to see them right in here for 200 beans. It's like one of the first shoes when you walk in, you'll find. They still got the OG box. I'm not sure if they're B-grades. I'll fat check that real quick. Let's grab a pair out. Let's take a look. I doubt they're B-grades. Nah, at least not on that. Not even on the label, nothing. Let's go behind the counter because I know they got some shoes behind the counter, man. So behind the counter, man, from left to right. Look at they got the pennies at the far left. You got the fives, you got some dunks. You got some yellow and black eights. You got some platinum set. I don't even know what those are called, those sevens. What are those joints called, man? Yo, my, my brain is disconnected. All right, when she gets out the way. All right, you got the heritage. Ooh, I like those, uh, those white and red ones man but they're women though and then they got the seven two and ten lows which i do have they have multiple sizes in those i think they're all going for retail though there you go all right guys man so we just left nike i'm empty-handed did not cop anything we saw a whole bunch of retros in the building which was dope it's crazy those 12s sitting on shelves don't know how they got there so quickly 7, 2, and 10s behind the counter, all that good stuff. We'll wrap it up at the crypto, man. Um, we're going to visit from other stores, but that's going to be a different vlog, so peak that. Um, it's going to be dropping right after this. All right, so I'll see y'all back at the crypto. Peace. And welcome back to the studio. Technically, the culture closet. <laughs> y'all remember that? But nevertheless, man, thanks for watching all the way through. If you made it this far, salute to you. Yo, I haven't changed the setup, so I was like, let me just do the outro here and give you guys a different look. But um, ironically, I'm doing this video talking about how rainy it is in Florida, man. From like May all the way to like September. Bro, it could be a lot of rain. Rain like two or three times per week. That's how frequently it rains. And right now we're going through a potentially tropical storm, which has upgraded to a hurricane, I think category three. It may slide through Central Florida, which I live. I know it's gonna definitely hit the, I know it's definitely gonna hit the West Coast first and it made its way up to Jacksonville, which is Northeast. So yeah. I'm in hurricane mode right now. It's crazy because it's about to be winter and we're still dealing with hurricanes. So I'm not lying when I tell you, yo, Florida is very tropical. It rains a lot and we get tornadoes. We get hurricanes. We get tropical storms, man. But nevertheless, I'm safe. Usually when this happens right before, like 24 hours before a storm hits, it gets very, very, very quiet, man. It's almost like a standstill. Y'all know when I was locked down for... 2020 and you look outside it's no traffic moving that's what it feels like right now 
no traffic is moving it's very airy bro like nothing is happening people don't want to leave their house they're cemented in their house waiting to like it to pass over but i'm all right we got enough food and water so we good we gucci if i don't lose power man maybe i can crank up some more videos but i gotta visit my mom so i gotta i gotta leave here shortly man try to get this video out and about on the interweb so you guys can see some content man um yeah quick question what do you guys wear when it rains i know we rock our shoes but do you guys have a rainy day shoe i do and my rainy day shoe is these joints these air jordan one dover street market patent leather things that navy blue bro i rock these majority of time when it rains matter of fact i might rock these today um during my visit so yo this this still pristine man this still pristine bro dope shoe dope shoe but anyways comment down below if you live in florida hope you're safe comment down below what y'all doing for the hurricane if you guys got any plans like i don't know if y'all do hurricane parties what do y'all do to pass time when this thing blow over us man hopefully everyone will be safe hopefully there's no crazy amount of damages to anyone in their property and i'm um, looking forward to see y'all when this thing blows over man i'm gonna see if i can make some content before it gets crazy man it doesn't hit until like tomorrow i don't know what time and, and i think i might get the the bands of the hurricane so it's not like the eye where it's coming you know what i mean like coming through us and it will be downgraded i think when it gets to our area hopefully hopefully anyways talk to y'all in the comments i'll see y'all in the next video peace